A uh, nice way to end up the day at Hollywood Bed Scottsville for Dennis Dry and all his patrons. Yeah, well done to all concerned. Sean Veal uh, uh, partnering this daughter of Lingari to victory and uh, Stuart Ferry doing duty for the yard as he always does. And um, nice way to end up the day, Stu. Yeah, she's, you know, she's always shown good work at home and she just hasn't really put it in at the race course. You know, it's just been green and learning that you know, she's slow away and then she runs on and she, she never gets there, you know. Uh, but today, she almost, you know, she put it together and she sort of showed what she's saying at home. Well, it was a last-minute change when you decided cheek pieces instead of blinkers? Yeah, because, you know, they, I mean, we tried them and they didn't really, I mean, they didn't make that much of a difference, you know. So I thought maybe cheek pieces wouldn't get, you know, might not be so slow away or what, and just a bit of a change. So just well done to Dennis. He made that call during the week and uh, thanks to Shawnee. Shawnee was, uh, you know, he was, wasn't overly confident, but he liked his chances, yeah? Yeah, like I say, she's, she's had us a bit confused, you know, like she shows good work and then sort of just doesn't quite put it in, yeah. Just well done to all the owners, you know, and uh, well, like I say, well done to Dennis. When's the boss back? Uh, well, we've got runners on the weekend and then uh, probably the week after that. Well, well done, Stu. Give him uh, our best and to all the patrons as well. Sweet, thanks, Dennis. Lovely, Stuart Ferry. Shawnee, uh, you went uh, overly confident. You said carrot sauce is the favourite, but, uh, you know, your horse is alive. You, you mentioned that. Yes, these I mentioned, she was alive this fully. Anybody watched the last run? She got done out the gates. Same like today, she got done out the gates. She just don't have luck this fully. But she put it all together today. I thought I'm going to win. Going away. And then when I hit the front at about the 2.50, she just dived right across the track. But uh, in saying that, she did win a good race today. Well done to Stewie. This fully looked well in the ring today. And she's duly obliged, you know. That's what she shows her at home. I didn't expect it to win a show like a half a length, but the win is a win. Well done to all the owners. They've had a lot of patience with this filly. But at the same time, she's been earning for them and uh, bringing her A game today. And she actually won a good race. Well done to the boss and his wife in Cape Town. Thanks for all the support to Stewie and Kerry. I can't stop thanking them. They're flying the flag well here. Yeah? And uh, I knew this stable was going to turn. I said to my wife this morning, I've got a feeling. Last week, we won the last race. This week, again, we won the last race. But uh, good day today, Dee's in the office. Lovely. And uh, the race itself, you know, it was a big field. Uh, luck in running plays a big part. And it was uh, up and down for most of you guys trying to jostle for position. Yeah, you know, it was a little bit early on in the race. Everybody was looking to get cover and nobody went really forward. They all, myself and I had a favorite always in my sights. He was just in front of me. Mm. And uh, he went out. I went in. I made a mistake earlier on. I should have gone in on the one horse of ours and... Uh, I went down the middle and I couldn't get a run. But at the same time, well done to all the owners for this. Also, to my wife and my two boys, it's been a good day for me. So I'm just blessed, Dees. Well done with your double. Safe travels back home. Thanks, Dees. Lovely. Sean Veal. And then Warren Lenferner handing the 1,000 rand to the winning groom of uh, Mission Beach. And that is uh, Mongezi. Mongezi, congratulations. 1,000 rand from... Hollywood Bets and Gold Circle. And that is a wrap of our race meeting this afternoon at Hollywood Bets Scottsville. If you caught this quartet in the lucky last, well played, nine, eight, seven, and three is the way they crossed the line. And a big thank you to all the guys concerned. Uh, Warren and Ferner doing all the parade ring previews for Gold Circle TV. Craig Peters calling all eight races. Uh, in the OB van, we had Salere Assimilation and Levi, Mr. Curry and Rice. And uh, a welcome return. Oh, yeah, Denver Grantham as well. Uh, that's uh, Mr. Uh, Chips as well. We forgot about him. He's back from the bush. And uh, a welcome return to uh, the parade ring uh, for our cameraman. And he is none other than the best and hardest working cameraman on course, who is none other than Zane. From myself, Dees Dynan, until we meet again, you enjoy what's left of your weekend. Take care.
Okay, now for our ride and star of the day. Well, uh, Raymond Danielson has had a wonderful weekend. Three winners at Turpentine yesterday, two winners this afternoon, including our feature, a non-black type uh, race, which was the Amtambuti Stakes, which was race number seven. And uh, he rode here for Gavin van Zale uh, on a horse uh, called Black Ball, the son of Black Mandalusia. And have a look at this finish in race number seven. Wealthy is towards the inside. Alcoys and Ellers will come out. Outside the 400, Seattle force the leader. Paths of victory marching on together between runners. The Dazzlers also running on. Black Ball, Alcoys, and then comes Ellers World as they come down to the 250 meter marker now. And the Dazzlers running a big race. Black Ball on the outside marching on together. And then Alcoys as they come to the last 200. Black Ball though takes it up. The Dazzlers trying to chase it home, but it's going to go to Black Ball. Second place, the Dazzler marching on together, and then came Wealthy. It's uh, finished there for number 13, Black Ball, and we congratulate the Fenzel team, all the owners, and of course, Raymond Danielson on a wonderful weekend. He's our star of the day.